It ain't no beats without them keynotes. Welcome to another episode of the Unfriendly Podcast. Yo, yo. I'm your co-host Marcus. It's your boy Richard. And we're back. Back for another one. Episode number four. Appreciate all the support, of course. Loving the feedback, by the way. Let us know how you feel. Likes, so, comment, repost. So right, really. Pushing these shits out there like Yeah we trying to put them out um, Merch is coming I know we keep on saying that But We got We got a team got a, Kind of ran into A major Yeah robot. <laughs> We really took an L Making these Took an L But uh, we're gonna get back We're gonna funny, get it The funny, website is already funny up Funny story by the way We'll talk about it yeah, one day. The website <laughs> is up They just Need the merch on there yeah. So Come in But like I said We got a team um, You know Working together You yeah. definitely need to put You know People in place Know your strengths Know your weaknesses um, So shout out to Jennifer Yeah For sure So we can definitely Focus Big on the website now The help has um, been Amazing from you Amazing lately. We appreciate it um, She would've got That shirts right for us Yeah <laughs> Niggas would've been Rocking t-shirts If she would've helped us Facts Facts um, Yeah so Water, Merch Merch is actually Like gonna come soon got For the black boys On the day Yeah Looking it's super kinda, crispy It's just kinda clean I, I mean, need to start Wearing these more yeah. Especially to the gym and shit So motherfuckers can see you working out And that shit be tough as fuck <laughs> Niggas will be reading your shirt in the fucking gym They definitely right. be looking <laughs> yeah. yeah so yeah first episode of the new year um, This year has been like flying by It's about to be March man. I know March It's crazy I feel like February was kind of February is quick as fuck February it was, un- it was a little quick But I feel like Naturally short honestly like short I don't know I, It kind of I feel this whole year Just been Going by so fast So Niggas been working Facts Niggas been Working hard as fuck But yeah I mean And then I feel like I know I say Winter Down here Like in the south But I feel like it's, it's been, been prolonged for, Yeah it's, it's been, been like Shitty time? weather So I, I moved to Atlanta Like in December I was only like An hour away But I'm in Atlanta now I've just been like shitty weather. Like it's like, raining like all the time. So I love it. I've been like going, you know, back and forth for the past two years. So nigga been outside lately. Yeah, <laughs> Marcus been touching <laughs> the touch of streets. Yeah, today, right, so that's where I'm at now. What's up? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, so I feel like last year was crazy. I feel like yeah, it's like last year was a movie for me. For sure, last uh, year was last year was a year, bro. <laughs> <laughs> last, last year was crazy. Last year so was a year, but we I'm, 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 I hopefully we can bring some of that energy into we, this year. I feel look, like this definitely year, looking forward to a better one for sure. Yeah, I like, can't say that. Repeat every time for the past two years. I've been like, "What's your New Year's resolution?" Like. Whatever I did last year, just better, just better. Yeah, just, just to have a better year. Yeah, just I, don't, do I don't think. I think everybody. Of course, you got you got to set a goal, try to try to hit it. Mm-hmm. But like, it's a lot to look forward to, and everything that you might be looking forward to might not happen. Right. But along along the process, you just wanted to be further away you was last year. I feel facts, that's the that's the facts, main facts, that's the main facts. thing. I want to I want to some be type a of progression. I, yeah, I want some, some type, type of progression from where I was last year. It can't be and doing, any, doing the same in any same capacity. Habits. Right, and the the little things matter. Yeah, and it, any any direction toward what you think. Right. So, right, right, yeah. So same same mindset for this year. Um, but yeah, last year was great. I had a great I had a great year last year. What was, what was great about last year? If you I know, mean, really everything. You know, why, why like, too. I just feel like the way I was just moving last year was just like with no fear. Honestly, just. I was just like willing to accept whatever experience I felt like I was gonna have. Um, you know, I feel like just I feel like that's just like a certain part of life, just to cre- keep on creating new experiences, like be in a space to learn, be in a space to just accept what comes. So I feel like I was definitely in that space last year. Um, shit, and it just worked. Like you know, I really put myself in a position to always, you know. Run into you know something new, yeah, something, something new. new. Like just put yourself, set yourself up yeah. to you know to always be willing to learn. As soon as you like feel like you know it all, feel like that's kind of when 
life gets boring. So right, right, right. that's how I can just describe last year, just being in a place to just learn and just, you know, create new experiences. So a lot of experiences I had, you know, from last year can, you know, definitely come into, into this year for sure. Yeah. But that's that, man. What we got, what we got going on today? So we got, we got some good stuff today. Um, Hopefully y'all can see the silver lining in the most of the things we talk about. We have too much backlash or so I'm what, looking what forward you? to all that though. I'm looking for <laughs> yeah, we, I'm looking for the likes, the dislikes and all that stuff. Uh, but um, so far everybody that has like watched our content has honestly put like positive feedback. So we haven't we haven't got that for uh, now. Yeah, for now. <laughs> for I mean, now. I mean, we're not roughing enough. Right. Fingers, if nobody's mad, nobody's upset. Nobody. It's, we but I mean, I feel like I'm like I don't like look for certain stuff, but it's just like honestly how I feel. Like yeah. I feel like that's just why we started doing the podcast. Right. Honestly, that's we were just it. we were just sitting. So my so we me and you know for those of you, I feel like most people don't know, but for those of you who don't know, like we are actually like blood brothers, like yeah. same mom, same dad. Um we live we lived together last year and uh shit we were just at home like bro let's just start a podcast <laughs> like it was just so like we have we were just naturally smoking chilling we would just naturally have these conversations like right, like right. mike was already in front of us on some Facts. on some real shit like not even trying to be cocky or nothing like we have these conversations normally this is not something we just Putting on a show for Right But like this is naturally What we would be doing On a regular night Chilling Watching the game Watching the game After the work You know Topic Someone pop up We see And we'll just Like dive into that For like a good hour Honestly A good hour Until you know And don't let it be like more than us Right Like there was more people At the crib Like it was even more Of a conversation Exactly And I was like bro There's so many podcasts Of people just like Talking just bullshit You know what I'm saying yeah. Like so I was like Bro I feel like we gotta You know In our opinion We have a voice And I feel like That's all that matters Honestly yeah. <laughs> Like yeah. I don't I don't really Um I'm not looking forward To like The Perfect You know Like what are you Looking to say You know yeah, so I feel I like That's like We got something to say We just gonna say it Like, like there's no Right or wrong right. To, to any of it Like if you feel like You wanna do something Just do it Like right. I, I feel like there's no difference between anybody else sitting behind the mic than me. Like, what do they have that I don't have? Right. So, I feel like that was like the energy that we just brought into that. Um, just got the equipment and All right. <laughs> that was it. Let's just do what we've already been doing. And like the one, the one thing is like I, I try. I never was like I'm gonna be honest. I was never a person to be. Just sitting at home or or whatever, just watching podcasts unless you like drink drink tam- uh, champs and shit. Shout out to drink champs. Like it's so hard to like find a podcast you naturally like can relate to. Yeah. Or they talking about something that is interesting, like just like an average average Joe type of motherfucker, right. like a regular person. Like I I went through a lot. Like when we like started. Yeah. Like first started. And I really couldn't find nobody who right. was like like talking that shit for real yeah, to, yeah, to make yeah. it was engaging unless it was some that's celebrity or big big person or some shit like that. And that's what we said. We was like, we want to want it to be something that we would right, listen right. to. Like when I sit down and listen, like to when I, I when like I go I back and like watch our shit, yeah. like I'm, I like I would watch this yeah. if it wasn't us. Like yeah, if it, right. if that was not us up there talking that's some shit, like right. I would I would watch this. Like and yeah. it's. It's it's that's hard to say that about a lot of people's shit. To be honest with you, like, right, right. So that's that's why I enjoy this, like on some real shit. Because like I, I would love to hear me talk. Right. Like, some real shit. Like, I like I like hear myself talk about the real shit. Yeah, like, yeah, I'm gonna yeah. talk about that real shit. We yeah. trying to we trying to say what right. y'all don't want to say in the yeah. in the best way possible. Like, right, that's, right. That's right. really what we're trying to do here. And I feel like you know anybody can have that mindset. It's not like. Just for us to have anybody can have that mindset. Like if you feel like you have a voice, like say it, right. do it. Like do whatever you want to do. Honestly, yeah. like if you're not like physically hurting nobody out here, yeah. like causing harm, you can just do whatever you want to do in life, just man. Do just it, bro. figure it out. Life is very short. Bro. <laughs> just uh, do it to not be out here trying shit and bullshit. Yeah, like, like it is what it is. Like nobody is nobody honestly cares. Yeah, but. and if they do, <laughs> fuck them. Right. Right, give a fuck about their opinions because it's opinions everywhere you go. Only right. yours matter. 
Do what you do, man. So yeah, so that's that's the energy. That's why we started the podcast. Um, I don't know if you think about doing one, do one, you know, whatever, do it. Because there's somebody out there that can relate. Yeah, somebody like, probably can relate. Is is your group is out there somewhere? Our group right. is out there somewhere, <laughs> listening to us, vibing with us, talking with it. So yeah, I, I know they. I know Stay they. Stay tuned to the vibe. Well, let's 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 get into this shit though. What's, what we got? What's our what's our first thing we jumping into today? Um, so I saw shout out to the rapper Simba. S Y M B A. I think that's. I'm pretty sure that's how you spell his name. Simba got some got, got some bangers. Yeah, he he's he got some sleepers for sure. He got bars for sure. Have he have he dropped anything this year? I don't think he has. He dropped an album last year. It was yeah. so much good music. I think that's something last year too, which is like more of a movie. Like the music, music was, last music? year, crazy. I can't I can't say that crazy. Oh uh, yeah, so Simba S Y M B A. Huh? We still giving Joey album of the year, even though mm, niggas. Was yeah, 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 yeah. This that album was hard, but he was on the. Um, I think Metro Metro album really yeah. has been. We was just listening to this shit. Shout out to Metro just one time. <laughs> <laughs> this album is. And its nah. album is really crazy. I listen to this shit probably every day on some real shit. Not even. Nah, I was listening to it. Today I listened to it today On my way here I, was, I definitely It definitely came You know SZA Went crazy to <laughs> SZA went retarded <laughs> She had SZA, I think on, on, Val- I, I, on Valentine's Day I think Kill Bill was like um, Number four trending song Of the other day so She's gonna go she crazy was, at the gra- Next year Grammy conversation She was going Crazy on Valentine's Day Next year Day. Grammy conversation SZA I feel like she's gonna clean up at least two, at least two Grammys. Something she got to get something. single and maybe album. She has to get something. How the single? I would say a single for sure. It's like one like, of those she singles. Gonna, she was on the Billboard for like weeks. And yeah, was whatever. Record I think it was like nine she, weeks. Yeah, the record she broke. So yeah, they have to recognize that. It was, it's yeah. like that. Come on, this is gonna clean up. But anyway, so um, but she he was on uh your, she has <laughs> songs in that she, she yeah no she got a lot of songs. She got a lot of songs. Um, yeah, so Simba was on the Poor Minds podcast. Shout out to the Poor Minds podcast. Yeah, and um, he said that men can be ugly, women can't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, damn. So he he was saying, as far as like, so take an ugly guy. If he got money, like that kind of. Kind of eliminate yeah. his ugliness a little bit. Like I know I've seen, and not my, not by my standards of ugly, but <laughs> by the your general standards? consensus. <laughs> general consensus of, of this thing is ugly. Hold on. <laughs> if everybody's Pause. saying that Pause. this thing is ugly, uh, that nigga's he's, ugly. He's, he's, <laughs> ugly. <laughs> he's considered you an know, ugly okay, nigga. Let's, like, let's, okay. <laughs> Before we go, before we go any further, let's always spread positivity. Let's always spread love. But What's you up? know, you know, What's up? Like, you know, you know, yeah, I mean, nigga, you know. Listen, like, sure, hey, you know, you know. I was like, you not, you know, you know what you are. <laughs> you know, you know where you stand in the social rankings. Yeah, let's, we didn't, let's I didn't create. Let's be it. honest. I didn't create the standard. Don't be sensitive. I didn't create the standard. I'm sorry. When I'm you, just when you wake up and you know you go yeah. look, at, look in the mirror. You know, you but no nah, niggas guy. be ugly though. Yeah. Like I'm just you know, so, they people say niggas but, be ugly. I'll say that, yeah. and uh, I agree with people. Yeah. <laughs> what they what they I saying, just agree with them. What I they say in this current. Yeah, I'm not creating the standard. Yeah. I'm not you spreading know, the negative. A lot of people saying is that then eh. I had to go with the um, but yeah so the common vote. <laughs> As far as women being ugly, same same thing again. You know, general consensus. Everybody's beautiful, everybody's beautiful though, yeah, in their own way. General consensus standards. Yeah. If a woman consider ugly, I feel like, unfortunately, I, I don't think it's fair because, like, fair to who? Fair to women, honestly. Like, because for us, we could just 
you know, really just buy, you know, it's like buy our affection or buy our love, you know what I'm saying? Like, and a lot of people would just look up, like, come on now, we've seen niggas like, damn, like what? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, what's going on with, with this type of situation? But the money kind of, you know, it's really not. It's really not a factor, you know. Put a, you know, put a bag on her, yeah, it on her, on her, on her arm. She you don't know. matter who she fucking at that. Point. It really don't matter. So, but for women, yeah. it's kind of harder. Like, yeah, I, I, I definitely say, I definitely say it is harder because people just put put money in the in the guy's pocket. Like his is, I really, feel, I feel like it's an ego ego thing, kind of maybe. Yeah, because you could you could carry yourself with right. so like, much confidence. Where it's right. like, so like how I feel and how I think of myself, I need her to somewhat look to that standard on some real shit. So if I if I'm okay. if I'm rich as fuck, like I feel like I or I should have the baddest on my side, regardless. So right. I, like you got you got to look apart. Right. But without a lot of niggas, gotta have money to pull. The, the girls they do that's let's, let's just be honest like yeah. let's like to a certain extent to to like, a certain extent for sure like if, right. if you see this is a, a perfect example like if you look at the um just look like, like niggas like in the NBA like you ever see like NBA wise yeah. bro like <laughs> NBA wise those niggas be having the baddest bitches bro like right. the baddest bitches yeah take away they not in the NBA money yeah. like come on let's let's just be realistic right, so but that, that's what I'm saying like right. that. Go alongs with right, right, like a non attractive guy can still get what he want, but is it the same for women? Like if they if they got the bag, I feel like it all depends on what they're there for. Like that's that's really what it kind of boils down to. Because if I if I meet um, somebody and she's you know um, not to the standards, (laughs) not to the standards, and she's rich as fuck, yeah. I'm a you know every nigga a nigga gonna be a nigga and, right. you know <laughs> slide in there get what he can but he gonna always like if you if I can't like if I can't look so you, you okay. if I can't look at you okay like, okay so you think that like it's tolerated so I, so so if I'm an unattractive guy a woman would tolerate me because of my money like yeah. for long for a certain amount of time I but think any, anybody would not but, even but, anybody but, saying, would, but like, vice versa if it's an unattractive woman. How long can a guy yeah, it's tolerate not, not them? long Damn. at all? Like I don't, I don't feel like that's that long because depending on the crowd you're, you're in and the things that you're doing, you're like I said, is you're just gonna be around like proper teams. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be around. You proper gotta be around team. the proper teams, yeah. and it's it's not gonna work. A female can do like like I said, uh, a female could go look better with money for sure. Like she can go. T- Take how much take better her, take her bag and look like a completely different person. Like we we see that. So like I said, depending on what what's the guy standard is of yeah. what he say yeah. is ugly or what he's attracted to, so, and why and why he's there. So like I said, so you so you saying is so you saying it is the same. Uh, unattractive female can, but if if get nothing away. fix the unattractiveness, <laughs> like. Can the money not fix the unattractiveness, or is it? I don't like, know. So it's I, beyond, is it beyond repair? <laughs> <laughs> is her face beyond repair? I don't. How far along? I don't know. Is it? I don't know. I don't, but I, I feel like, and I can see why he he said that because I just feel like the so called attractive, or I'm sorry, the so called unattractive woman is just there's not much that they can do, like. How much makeup does she have? A body, <laughs> unattractive, no body, or unattractive with a body? Ooh, that's tough. I mean, <laughs> that's that might we don't we that don't hit might some it. <laughs> <laughs> we don't hit some duckies before because of the mm. body. We gotta, let's be honest. Let's 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 be honest. That can help. Let's it, it can help for sure. It, that's a. Um, <laughs> That helps. That's one, a plus. One hundred percent. So that helps a lot. But I, like I, I don't know. I, I just feel like I could see where the biasness comes in because, like, once somebody can you know considers a a, a woman ugly, like it's like damn. All right, there's really nothing that you could do with that. Yeah, it's, it's no going back. Like, buy some hair, put some hair on, mm-hmm. like. 
I don't know. Get some make get your makeup done. Maybe you know the lashes or something. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what could. How, well, that, once again, like. <laughs> How long does that last? Yeah, like, I don't. That's not, that's what I'm saying. Like, like I can't, you, you say that we can't. After all that, they still yeah, ugly. Like, <laughs> we can't wait only to the first for you to look good. <laughs> you can't only look good around the first or the fifteenth. Like that's not. Oh we, man, you gotta look. We got three sixty five, twenty four seven, seven days a week. You gotta or just yeah. You gotta look good. I get, I get you. you know what I'm so you like, saying like so. It's harder for women to buy their beauty. Yeah, I feel like. Okay, I get yeah, that. I mean, I get that. I hate to say it, but a lot of people feel like they have to now, and I don't feel yeah. like a lot of people like. A lot of people will prefer you not with all that. Like you don't, you don't have yeah. to go that far to feel like you look good. Like that's what that's one thing that like I kind of I kind of hate about like like the makeup and shit. Like you feel like you have to look like a completely different person to feel like you look good. Right. At by the time you're done, you don't look like yourself. But, so it's like you looking in the mirror, like damn, I look good. That's not you. Like yeah, yeah. that's not you. You don't need to go that far to for, feel like, for the people that use it for that. Like some people, some people, I feel like I don't know. Like they, they feel like they can't. Feel like themselves unless they have yeah like because they 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 fell in love with somebody that's not them like, right, I hate right. to say it but that's that's really what it yeah. boils down to you st- but, did you see that uh that, um I think uh, the Ruth sent it to us where is that TikTok that? of like a uh, oh the, the filter yeah, shit? yeah the like, filter that was crazy be careful out here TikTok is filters <laughs> changing Sick, yeah. changing their faces. I saw one was like it was like this like if you're like they were older. People and they were like, yeah, like they look, they young. look younger. Twenty yeah, years, crazy. not twenty years off a of filter. It was like crazy. The, the craziest shit was was like the teeth. Like, this yeah, shit, I saw the teeth. That shit put a grill on your mouth. <laughs> like, it put a whole, it put a whole yeah. new set of teeth in my <laughs> mouth off a of fucking filter. Hey, and online we are right demon, now? we are demon bitches off Instagram. We don't even. You look. Bro, that's not you. Like I, I feel say, sorry like, for everybody. That's not who they are. That's in the online dating. Arena right now, it is not safe. Yeah, I don't. I'm not. You don't. I'm not. And I can't be in that arena. <laughs> like, I, that's not a. All that's not, a, that's not an arena right for me. now. Is not where you should be. Like, I can't. You need I don't to know. Exit that arena. I don't know who this is. I don't know who I'm double tapping. <laughs> is, is this you or your friend? Like, <laughs> I, we're, I, I, we're I Lincoln, at, and this is not. Listen, you. I was at the bar the other day, and this older guy, he just like started. I'll be honest. I I don't. I have my moments. <laughs> Most of where, listen, where I'm, where I'm social, like you know, I have my moments, right? Where I'm like social, I'm in, like I'm feeling. But sometimes I have my moments, like I'm at the bar, you know, just chilling after a day. You know, you just go there to relax, whatever. Relax with your friends. Right, right. You don't have to be at it, wherever you relax at. But that's just where ha- I happen to be. Not talking to nobody. Mm. Like when people just like want to start a conversation with you, yeah. like I didn't ask to be a, <laughs> right. Like I don't want to. I actually don't want to be in a conversation with you. I hate talking. I, <laughs> <laughs> I would actually prefer for you not to do what you're doing right now. Like yeah. just don't talk. I, I don't. I didn't come here to talk to anybody. So he like leans over to me. And he's like. You know, it hates being, I hate being, no, it sucks being stood up. I'm like, all right. Why are you telling me? Well, okay, what? Oh, all right, okay. So I'm like, you know, I'm not trying, I'm not trying to be an asshole. I'm like, all right, it's an older guy. I wouldn't have said shit. (laughs) I would have ignored him. It's an older guy. So I'm like, all right. I would have ignored him. So I'm like, all right, what's up? Like, what happened? Like, so anyway, um, he tells me some, 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 Hopefully it was a woman because it seemed like he was attracted to women. Um, he was like, uh, "This is third time she stood me up. She didn't even send me a text. The least she could do is like send me a text and like let me know." Oh, um, you didn't learn that's, 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 <laughs> that she wasn't coming third time. And I was like, "So you never met her?" He's like, "No." Nah. He's like, he started chuckling. It's like, "Yeah, it's an online dating thing." I was like, "Oh my god, bro, you don't even know." And he told me he made her. You ever? I don't know. You've probably seen the memes or like movies and stuff where they're like uh, 
go take a picture with a spoon in the kitchen or yeah, something yeah, like that. Yeah, he told me he approved. Yeah, he told me he made her do that, but it was like hours later. Like he, she took a couple hours to send to send him that picture. Yeah, you're an idiot. But yeah, that's that's what's out there on the date in the online dating world right now. Fake Unless, faces and like a lot of like I being said, asked to take when you, pictures with spoons. Right, yeah, like that's not, I'm not. I'm not doing that. It's not, don't don't get blocked over some dumb shit. If unless most people that's on social media, the people that they're following, like don't live locally. Like to be honest with them, yeah, the, the yeah, people yeah, that you yeah. about to try to slide on DM, they probably don't live locally. Mm-hmm. You can't like s- s- see something on social media. They just live in Texas. Yeah. All right, let me let me go crazy for this. Right. Like, come on, bro. Like, that's, <laughs> Let's be realistic. I agree. Like, you, 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 you can't. You can't. You can't do that. You like, slide like, in yeah, like to, you, to Houston. You slide in the Cali. It's living fucking <laughs> the DR, and you gonna slide in. <laughs> you gonna slide in her DMs talking. Man, yeah, right. You don't know what that is fucking, over there, bro. Yeah, like, you you setting yourself up for failure. I promise yeah, so, you. So yeah, like it's 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 crazy out here. But some people, you know, they that they attracted to that. Some people are attracted to the more natural look. Yeah. Like I don't know. Like what do you, what do you, what do you feel like you? I feel like some things just fit <laughs> for different scenarios. Sometimes the natural look fits, and natural look always fits. You think so? Always. I mean, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, like I just. Well, I, <laughs> All right, let me. Uh, <laughs> hey. All right, hold on. Let me. Um, He's really a demon. Listen, everybody be talking I, about the podcast, but uh, Marcus, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> this guy right here I, is really I, a I wanna, demon. I want to, like I said, I want to say this as right. but like, easy it's, going it's so, as possible. You, you have a preference, you have a preference. That's just how I, I want to. I want to go to sleep. And wake up next to the same person. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't, <laughs> I don't want to wake up next to a different person I fell asleep with. I'm, I'm just gonna be honest. Like I, I okay, you have to like, be the okay, same person. Okay, but you give me like the worst possible experience. No, that's, like no. So that's people not, are just that's not the worst. <laughs> that's that's normal. Like that's very normal. Like that's that's what people like, deal with is, every single day. Like. I'm waking up next to a stranger. Like this, like, was, I don't know. This was what? not you. Not even on. I was drunk last yeah, night. Yeah, no, no, no. yeah. Like I woke up next to a different all, person. You see like, all the attachments. Yeah, like on the, <laughs> on the, on the, <laughs> her her attachments <laughs> and perks <laughs> is sitting on the dress. <laughs> the silence. No, <laughs> Bro, what is it called? Oh, Call of Duty, the uh, ACOG, the ACOG scope, <laughs> the ACOG scope is in the bathroom seat. Like, got the extendo, yeah, the extendo mag dead, on the bro. nightstand, the extended mag. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, Mark's up. Bitch dead. got all the upgrades. <laughs> Oh my god, bro! Oh, look, she shit. got a uh, what is it called when it fall from the sky? Fuck that yeah. fucking <laughs> care package. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch had to call in the kill streaks to go out on the date. Yeah, like, that's not. Dead. Like, come on, dog. Bitch got an airstrike. <laughs> Oh my god I'm fucking weak Yo, bro, Fuck like out of here I'm fucking gotta, dead Man that shit funny as fuck We gotta Bitch got a 20 kill streak That's just We gotta be realistic Everything's man. unlocked you can't, you can't keep that shit up Every day like Yo nigga gonna wanna see Just some natural beauty like, But hold on listen bro That Listen just, that shit is expensive though Yeah That's what I'm saying Bro like, like of you can't a helmet, can't. <laughs> bro. A helmet is like you can't like oh, like three hundred dollars, bro. Yeah, but like we we can't come home and you. But listen, but you, I'm listen. I'm trying to justify you, you're, you hanging up your hair. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> listen, not, listen, not, listen, this, listen. This is for 
Nothing. Nobody in specific is everybody. Like well, yeah. it's, it's not. This is it's a worldwide well, listen, thing. So okay, I'm, 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 I'm gonna say I'm gonna say two things. So the first thing, it's expensive. Like, yeah. like the frontals they they cost a lot. So so imagine us like buying up like a pair of like three hundred dollars shoes, four hundred dollars shoes, and never wearing them again for a picture. But I'm saying like for, so for like so picture. you buy I, I buy a pair of shoes and I never like that when they spend money on their hair, like it's supposed to like they want it to last a certain amount of time. Long, so though. I mean I, I guess that you know, just being frugal or whatever, but But they so, look, yeah, but, like, but, but but I'll say some okay. people if you if you bad, you bad. Like if you <laughs> I feel like if you you could pull I, you can pull it off. If you a bad you can pull off natural look, helmet look, but like my, whatever, my whatever. Thing, look. My, my thing is, is like I, I understand. Like everybody don't got the long ass hair. Got that. Everybody yeah. got what they got. But at the same time, like I don't. My thing is, I don't want you to just like legit like how I said earlier. I don't want you to like something more that's not you like right, right, that's right. that's not it. who you are that's not how you naturally look yeah. like i rather you accept <sighs> but i accept feel like what accept your features yeah and work with what you got and make that as presentable as possible so you can feel like okay, that's so this, your this best I'm like not, not turning into somebody else right. like that's that's the thing that i i fucking hate well this this is what i'm gonna say i feel like now it is it is who they are, like yeah. that is their identity. Yeah. So like, what do you say? <laughs> like, what do you? What do you, what do you <laughs> like, what do you say? Like, I'm not saying that, that is their identity. Like being, you know, like whatever they put on, that is that's their identity. So like, that's how they feel. That's when they feel themselves. Yeah. When yeah, I don't. Yeah. When the care package drop, that shouldn't. That shouldn't be. <laughs> that shouldn't. That shouldn't be. Like I don't. I, like, I hate I don't that it's know. like, like that. But, but listen, I'll I'll say like, I'll meet you where you at. Like if that's that's how you feel, that's you know like you know yeah. I'll meet you where you're, and then whatever you know, <laughs> whatever don't, happens, that is like what, what I'm happens? not gonna. I, I don't think either way would like, like. Stop me! I just have to see what's right, beyond right, that. Right, you know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? Like either either look like that's that's but how I'm, I feel. If you look good, you look good. Yeah, like fuck if you, it, if you bad, need... like pull off whatever, wear whatever, do, do what the fuck you want. Shit, Richie's my slide in your DMs. <laughs> <laughs> but at the end of the day, we gotta wake up and go to sleep. And no, yeah, I, feel person, I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. And that's when it gets scary. Like. Yes. But I'll be honest, I've never had to deal with that. Hmm. I never had to deal with it. Never? No. That's cat, bro. That's cat? That's Who had cat. that? Were you talking about go and wake up to a different person? Nobody ever. Like, just no. Nobody I know. Like, been solid. So I'm saying, what you, I'm, saying I'm saying what you. No, listen. <laughs> I'm saying what you saying, like go to sleep, yeah, okay. something, and wake up something. Yeah, else <laughs> I've never, okay. yeah, the, like whatever I saw was what I saw. Yeah. <laughs> they, they didn't change. You know what I'm saying? Like oh, no, whatever was on stayed on. <laughs> I guess <laughs> like nothing. nothing, <laughs> nothing to yeah, like nothing was yeah. laying on the. So I don't feel you know for the people that are dealing with a whole different. You know, I don't, I don't, I can't relate. Sorry, but at the same time, do 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 you though? If that's if that's what you got to do to yeah to feel good, then be yourself. That's, that's yeah, like that's if that's what you're comfortable with, and that's what you got to do to feel that's to to feel like you feel attractive or feel good. Then yeah. then I can't. You can't really say shit when it comes to that. Then, but at the yeah. same time, it's like can't. Be just be realistic, bro. Just be realistic. It's not you. How many? I feel like you. You got PTSD. You. Yes, <laughs> I do. Maybe, maybe a little. Maybe a little. I've, I've encountered it once, Dang. but it's like it's. It was just one and done. It was never yeah. like a. You learn. So it's one time got one you time scarred. It's, uh, it's all it, it all it takes one time. It's, 
Like he's I say, scarred. Buddy got trashed three times. Well, well, yeah. well I was there a third. Yeah. Like, right? <laughs> three times. And you can't take three L's. You can't take three L's in life. You only can take <laughs> one. You get three strikes, you're out. You yeah, can't I take three know. L's. Like, what, what are we doing? What Let is, me know. If you've been scarred yeah, like, like him, if you woke up to something else, yeah, it's just... Uh-uh. It's gonna be a support group for y'all. He's uh, yeah, he's the leader of we'll it. We'll be hosting that. He got y'all. We could talk talk real front unfriendly <laughs> at that at that. He's uh, gonna start like a uh, what is it called? <laughs> um, close friends yeah. of <laughs> of a scarred group. But me. that's that. Yeah. So overall, let, let so let let me know how y'all feel. Can women or men so called be ugly? Is it is it equal? Like. Can you can men get certain things that uh, it would take like, a lot for a woman to look in the mirror and say I'm ugly? Like you, that's what I'm saying. You gotta you so gotta, that's you, gotta have I, a, you gotta have a shitty friends agree. and shitty support that. group yeah. for a woman to go in the mirror and say I'm ugly. Like no, nope. but not because it it be the negative bro, ones. I, I, I would like say oh, this hundreds. A, confidence like, is crazy. Yeah, like also I'm. I be seeing females have more confidence than males. I could say that. I I feel like they got a little bit more confidence than males. It's, it's, a nigga, it's up there. A nigga will, or he will he will accept yeah. what he is. Yeah, that's that's yeah. what we do. If yeah. I go look at me, all right, that's all right, true. Richard, this is this is what you are, and this yeah. is how I'm gonna play along. All right. A female don't give a fuck no, they what do. they talking <laughs> about, <laughs> bitch. I'm a thousand. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a I'll break the scale. Ask the bitch. Well, rate yourself one to ten. Yeah. Fifteen. Yeah. Like it's never, it's never one through ten. Nah, never. Absolutely. Have you ever? You a girl it's has never said I'm a, a seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On, yeah, on some real yeah, shit. Yeah. So like it's it's really like a a girl would never say I'm ugly. I don't, that you would, don't that really would run happen. into a lot of women like out like when you approaching them like that have. And that in that moment they have high confidence. Like right, you, as it's they hard should. to like, as they should. Like yeah, so. I feel like it's, I don't know. Uh, let me know what y'all. Let me know what yeah, y'all boy. think. But yeah, definitely want to hear y'all feedback on that one. I feel yeah. like I might have some. That's a good. That's a good. Something to say about that one. But it's a lot of. I don't know. These niggas be be pulling some bodies. That's that's that's, that's <sighs> different. Ugly ass niggas. That's different. Know. Off of off of probably just being funny type shit. So. Yeah. Personality, it's, it's it, you gotta yeah, have pers- something. Yeah, your personality will go a long way. <laughs> My looks will go even further. Oh man, but yeah, yeah so that's that. that, man. We we off that. Let let us know what y'all think. Um, what did you think about the uh, the halftime show, Rihanna? Well, um, the Super Bowl. Yeah, Super Bowl. Bro, that, shit, that shit was kind of lit. Like I, yeah. I I I don't know what. I mean, nobody nobody knew she was pregnant at the time. Yeah. That so was like, kind of crazy. Like, yeah, that was yeah. that was pretty dope, like how she revealed it. But um, I think a lot of people had a lot of higher standards of what she was going to do. Yeah, I feel like Rihanna's music kind of like speaks speaks for itself. Yeah, like I don't. I mean, she is a performer, like performer, but like um, like Beyonce does like insane fucking shows. Yeah, like Rihanna, like music is really is really the shit. Like on some real shit. Like just be honest. So. Finding out she was pregnant and doing what she did, like what the fuck did y'all want her to do? Like a split? Like <laughs> yeah, they y'all like, want her to be Cardi B and twerk on the fucking stage or some shit? Like while she was pregnant, like actually pregnant, she so. had a baby inside her and this. she was fucking hundred <laughs> feet in the fucking air. Like what the fuck were y'all expecting that was, to see? And that's crazy you said that because a lot of people just disregarded. That yeah, she was pregnant. That she was pregnant. Like oh, they didn't she see did, her. She didn't, she the, didn't dance her stomach. Like she, she uh, didn't dance enough. I mean, what? <laughs> what, did, what the fuck did you want to see? What did you want to see? Did y'all want her to spin on her stomach? <laughs> like, what, the, what the fuck? Some b boy shit. Like, uh, like I said. So once I so I so once I noticed she was pregnant, I was like okay, like all right, she's a yeah, pregnant. And like, like the, the accepted for what it is. Shit, like the dancers and how the stage was going. Like that yeah, shit. Yeah. That shit was pretty fucking lit. I don't like. I don't yeah, know. She was. She was like. I've never seen her perform. Right, right. Like, I can't think of any like award show or anything that I saw her perform. Honestly, I don't. I can't yeah. think of you may, but I don't. So that's my first time ever like seeing her like any award show or anything like perform. So I took it for what it was. It's right, crazy that right. she was pregnant though. I'm not gonna yeah, lie. Like that's said, crazy for what for what she did. That shit was pretty fucking dope. But she just she should have had you know somebody. Yeah. She really she really set the standard for pop out with her 
but yeah, yes, yeah, she had a feature, should have had a feature for sure. But like you for just said, like women, would have set that bitch off. Yeah, for sure, absolutely. But absolutely, yeah, I, I gotta stop judging people so much. <laughs> Facts. She was pregnant. What, like, what are we saying? What were you, do, for, what were you for doing the, when you were pregnant, bro? I was just about to say. <laughs> what were you doing? Eating pickles and you Cheetos. Were, Eating a fucking can a can of peanut butter. <laughs> she's she's performing the Super Bowl. She really you set know. the level of just like you don't know who your pregnant. baby daddy is. <laughs> and you're worried about her not dancing enough for her Super Bowl. What's what's happening? You're there? trying to figure out how many yeah, people you take in the Mori. Yeah, like what the and fuck? You, and you seven months in. Yeah, talking shit. Get the fuck out of here. People are insane. <laughs> bro. Fucking loser. People are really people are really fucking insane. Like that shit crazy. Like you, yeah. can't, you can't do nothing right. You, bro. you like, really you can't, can't, bro. Do it. You that's gotta, what I'm you saying, got, once bro. You, once just, you accept, like motherfuckers will always talk oh shit my or find something to talk shit about. Life would be so much easier, bro. Cause like I, I think I think I stopped giving a fuck too early. <laughs> honestly, like I don't, I no, just heard I just heard no, twenty four. I, I stopped giving a fuck like. Too early, bro. Yeah. Like I, I, like I realize that shit. Like I don't give it's a fuck never what, you, too early. what you think or what you're talking about. Yeah, and like I feel like a lot of people feel like I give a fuck what you yeah, have to yeah. say. I true, don't. True, like true. I really, I really don't. She set the bar for just like women just fucking shit up. Yeah, and being pregnant too. Yeah. Like that was. I feel like I feel like a lot of females should have. Like applauded her just for that, just for being pregnant, just for being pregnant. And I feel that. I like why? That. I fuck with that. Why was that not? I mean, everybody yeah. was like posting the memes and shit in the videos of trying to see if she was pregnant. But like, why was there like so much negativity? Like she was yeah. pregnant. I should like, like yeah, that, that was pretty fucking dope. But yeah, I mean, who <laughs> else know. will perform pregnant? I don't, she, 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 I don't know. Was she? I don't know. She's the first person to do that. I, I don't, don't know. know. We, we might should, have to. We should look that up. Look that let, up people know. Let, let us know if y'all know. Especially at the fucking Super Bowl. Like, yeah. come on. And she they did not, a lot of movement. They're not doing that shit. She did a lot of movement. Right. Like being pregnant. But right. I don't know. I don't know the capacities of what you can and can't do being pregnant. Yeah. But I'm sure that's not a norm. A norm. They want, <laughs> they want the torque on yeah. the hand, handstand. <laughs> Fuck. But yeah. But you know, like. For the woman artist that's looking up to her, like that's just like setting the standard yeah. of like just like go get it, like, get out there, no matter what. Like, yeah, get out there, like, fuck. And you don't know where your career will take you, like being pregnant or not being pregnant, whatever kind of you know, right? Um, female. Like, what if she would have canceled it and not done it because she was pregnant? Then right, what? Right. Then what? Then everybody would have been mad. Then, yeah, then they would have dogged she's her, pregnant. dogged her for real. Like, yeah, you yeah. can't, you can't win. Let's see what you do But yeah, like man. I said I feel like for a lot of Female artists Looking up to her I feel like that was definitely Like inspirational And you know Female artists been Really been having their way Yeah The past couple years How do you feel about Female rappers Like do you, are you in Art what's, I, what's your take on a female So art, I'm not gonna lie And you know this Like in our group chat Alright A lot of freestyles Yeah <laughs> Lotto freestyles really be she can crazy. Really, she can really fucking rap. Lotto freestyles she be, can really fucking rap. Be on some shit. I so think, like, yeah, like if it comes to me, like I'm not gonna like I'll entertain it. Like, you don't you don't go in the car and just search a lot of hit play. Um, <laughs> what you about? I'm not gonna like. Mm, yeah, I'm not gonna yeah. probably. I'll be, I'm not gonna search her. I'm That's not gonna tough. search. But that don't mean. She can't rap Yeah Like who am I Fuck what I You know what I'm yeah. saying My opinion is not shit On what she got going on But um, Yeah she can rap Yeah I feel like Go ahead Out of Out of A lot of them um, I feel like Megan and Lotto Really could spaz On some real shit No yeah Megan Megan freestyles be hard but like, too I feel, I feel like that's what That's what The, the freestyles and shit I feel like that's what Kind of gets the Male Right Audience right. for sure because you can't just be in your car listening to a lot of this. If you are, yeah. let's let's stop that <laughs> right while we're ahead. <laughs> you can't pull up to red light and you're bumping Lotto. Let's not do that. Um, if you are, it better be feature somebody. Right, um, right. She better be a smart song. If you get on the car, it's just you by yourself listen yeah. to Lotto. We we I, but I feel like other for, things to talk about. For women, they don't really care about that because they could capture 
like so many different audiences. Yeah, yeah. Like, and they're gonna and they're gonna be hurt. Pop. They're gonna be hurt. So you gonna yeah, they're gonna be hurt regardless. So it don't make sense for women to just like just rap. Because can you sing? Because if you, I feel like if you can sing and rap, you'll get further than if you can just rap. Right, right, right. So I feel like for a lot of female artists, they it, it don't really matter. You know, yeah, they may have a few bars or whatever, but um, I feel like Young May is still shitting on all of them, bro. Yeah, Young May still. She don't be. I don't know what it she don't, be. It don't matter. Like she I don't, don't think nobody fuck on Young and May. Yeah, yeah, she got bars on the female side. To be honest with you. Like, she definitely had bars. <laughs> insane. And she's and she's better than a lot of niggas. Oh uh, yeah, true. That's the fact. She's better than a lot of niggas. I will put her above <laughs> a lot of people right now. Oh, absolutely. And with no absolutely. fucking no fucking debate. I so that's one thing I will say. Like she never cared about going commercial. Yeah, for sure. Like I, she's I, like I don't know right now she's if like, she ever signed with somebody. I'm pretty sure she's still independent. Like yeah, I, probably. I, I'm I pretty sure she still is. I don't think she signed with anybody if I'm not mistaken, but she's definitely still independent. She's like ready but, to like battle rap right yeah, now. Yeah, like that. And it's, it's bars, bro. Yeah. And I feel like a lot of, I mean, we gotta, you gotta make the, the, the summer bops or whatever for the ladies. Get that's, the bag. That, yeah, that's, like that's, that's where the bag yeah, comes in. If it's commercial, if it's pop, you gotta, you gotta get what you here for. Yeah. But when it comes to bars, like a lot of, like guys, like, I, Regardless of what she's talking about, most of the time they talking about fucking or some shit. Yeah. But if regardless you a male or a female, if you just you spin bars, like I'm gonna listen to it. I, I don't yeah. give a fuck who you are. Yeah. But it's it's hard it's hard to find that. Mm-hmm. It's to, to to find that balance to make it just okay to listen to every day or right. just put it in the playlist. Like right. a lot of you can't just put every. But I did, I in like playlist. overall in general. I'll say this like. I I would rather listen to like women artists that like are R and B singing, yeah, for sure. Singing, that's, for that's sure. just my one hundred percent. That's just my preference. One hundred percent. If I if I yeah, I, I yeah. listen. To, I feel like I listen to more R and B, bro, than rap in general. Yeah, you know, anyway, that's not that's not that's, <laughs> yeah, not, like, that's a topic general, for another like, day. I, we can talk about music. Yeah, like I just I feel like I just listen so for days. I'll um. But R and B, like the Scissor album, like yeah, we like, just talking about that. So like, I'm a, I'll listen to that. It's really like for sure. It's really like peace of mind. Like yeah. I, you can't just wake up, yeah, just just, just <laughs> to spin and pop. Like you, you can't just wake up to just. I'm about to shoot a nigga. Like it's you can't <laughs> wake up and go to sleep. It's just yeah. not good for the mental. Like you, yeah. like R and B just is it just keep you. Just you calm, know. mellow. Yeah. Like this is where this is where this is the mindset I need to be in throughout the day, just to to get me through the day. Right. The hype shit, of course. Like you gotta, you might you in the you, gym, you or might something. yeah, at the gym or some shit, or when you go to Sometimes. work, you just gotta turn that switch on because Going you hate to, yeah, something. like some shit. But like R and B will always be superior, bro. Yeah. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hold you like, like that. When I'm in the car, it's R and B because it's like if it's not like our like my definition of like rap and hip hop, I just I was not interested. Yeah, like, let's just talk about something else, right? Because that's, so that's not really. But I have, I feel like the rap music is more of a vibe anyway. I feel like modern rap music is. Kind I mean, of like it's, it's R&B, definitely honestly, it, yeah, for sure. It's, it's definitely going that way because everybody yeah. singing auto tune type shit. But like, it's, awesome. like, so it's like just like Metro album, like it was, it had its ups and downs, yeah. but it was still like mellow. The um, you know what I'm saying melody, like I say, it's, yeah. it's all about it's all about a, a good fucking melody. Like just yeah. if it's a melody, most artists are going for a melody now, yeah. something that is catchy. Facts. So you ain't you ain't got to rap. Right. Non stop, no, yeah. Point. So that's I would just rather listen to uh, uh you know, a woman artist, yeah. female artist, female artists, but sing. I'll definitely when some shit new shit drop, yeah, just to yeah, just see what it's talking about, yeah, just to see what it's talking and about. And for real, it's, go listen to a lot of freestyles, bro. Yeah, a lot of these, <laughs> she's really different. A lot of is really, she, she's really that for real, and she's fine as fuck, too, yeah. She's fine as hell. Lotto's crazy, man. <laughs> Lotto's really crazy. I ain't gonna lie to you. 
Lotto's That's, fine as fuck. Y'all gonna have Megan. Give me, give me Lotto. Damn. Give me Lotto, bro. Lotto over Meg? That's some real shit. I don't know what it is, man. Mm. I'll take Lotto. That's. Mm, I don't make it big, man. <laughs> Meg is tough. You gotta climb that. You gotta. Ooh, that's I'm an climbing. adventure. <laughs> uh, take me. <laughs> take me that's on the adventure, whole, please. That's bitch. a whole mission. I'm here for bro. it, bro. That's a whole <laughs> mission, bro. That's not. I feel like Meg would. I feel like Meg would give you a run for you. <laughs> I don't know if I want that smoke. <laughs> Meg with all the smoke. I don't know smoke. if I want that smoke. I feel bro. like okay. I Vegas. will say that. I will feel like Vegas. Lotto might fold. Ooh. I feel like yeah, Lotto might fold. She got, fold a, she got a more of like yeah, a little yeah, uh, yeah. feminine vibe. Meg might destroy you. Meg, what? <laughs> <laughs> what you want, nigga? <laughs> Meg know. might hit a freestyle yeah, after like, she yeah. does. We <laughs> <laughs> might beatboxing while we fucking. <laughs> Bye, bye. Bro, yeah, Meg might know. Meg might like that one, bro. fucking schedule she, studio time gotta, while she's fucking you. There's a pick the phone <laughs> up. Why you fucking able to pick the phone up? I ain't doing nothing. <laughs> What's up? I'm What's actually up? not what, busy at all. Know, what, 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 where we going? Like she'll pick the phone up. A, yeah, I feel like Meg a demon, bro. Get but that, you, but low key, that's how it be because like a lot of be talking some nasty shit. A lot of these bitches that be talking that nasty shit, yeah, like, yeah they, they be, be folding, they be soft, they be they soft, be cap. they be soft. They be but cap. I, I like that though. I'm not I like gonna that. lie, I take they be the, cap. I take yeah. the soft woman any day. Meg will, Meg will give you everything you you're looking put for. On the armor plates for that. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta be. Oh, you gotta up. get a care package. You gotta get a fucking <laughs> juggernaut. <Yeah. laughs> Yeah, I got a juggernaut to go after that one right there, bro. Oh, you shit. Gotta come prepared. That's crazy. Man. It's the unfriendly podcast, bro. We're going to try to keep episodes rolling. Yeah. We, them. we know we've been big gaps in yeah. the episodes dropping. We're going to try to. We're going to get it right, though. But people be looking forward to it. Yeah, so, so, I'm, you know. I, I you know so keep tuning in yeah keep tuning keep in keep sharing keep, keep subscribing sharing. let us know how gotta, I feel DM us we, we comment. want the feedback we appreciate the feedback so far for sure absolutely um it's unfriendly podcast yeah we here we out we ain't going nowhere it ain't no beats without them keynotes.